I know most of you never thought this day would come, but unfortunately, I've had to deal with this all week. So Kim Kardashian West and Courtney, you're both problematic. So everybody knows that I love the Kardashians. On Hollywood Unlocked, I do my best as a journalist to be unbiased. Wait, is that where you don't pick a side? Yes. Yes. Okay, well, never mind. The Kardashians and Jenners are some of the most famous and powerful people on social media and in entertainment. We're the biggest target ever. We've been in their lives for 17,000 years. He's being disrespectful. We've seen everything from Kylie, two Kylies, one with lips and one without. Kylie Jenner's lips. We've seen Caitlyn Jenner, one with a penis and one without. None whatsoever. We've seen Kim Kardashian with a husband and another husband. On an Italian hillside. Both times after a couple of months. Damn, this is messy. I'm finally gonna break down the walls of the Kardashians. They already been broken. I will cut you. I'm gonna dig a little deeper. No, nah, that's not it. Peek inside, no. Nah. I'm gonna probe. Why does this all sound like something you do at a gynecologist? Good. Let me run through each of the Kardashians one at a time. Damn, I feel like I've heard that before. <sighs> now we've all come to know the Kardashians and Jenner since 2007 when E put them on TV and put us all under a trance. Perfect. People online always say that I fail to see how they've been stealing from the black culture. Call us the KKK. So I asked my team at Hollywood Unlocked to give me some examples because I don't really miss too much around here. It's kind of frustrating. They say that Kim's been through many shades of African American since she started as a pale Persian back in early 2000s. I think you're in denial. Um, then she wore box braids and everybody said that she created the hairstyle, but my team said that was a lie. You are so jealous. You are just so tired. And maybe she did date a black guy or many. I don't even remember everybody she's dated. Let me think. Oh well. Do you want me to make you a collage? Enough of that. I don't think I need to be another man in Kim's life tearing a woman down. I'm gonna let you finish. And it's ironic. Kim Kardashian started her career making over other people's closets while the whole time Bruce was waiting to fall out. Don't even go down this road because I'm not talking about it. <laughs> Hell, when Bruce turned to Caitlyn, Chris said, I'm going black and I ain't never coming back. That's where Corey Gamble came in. <laughs> <laughs> now listen, we gotta let Kim Kardashian West be the melanin queen that she wants to be. I mean, Skims is for people of color and so is her makeup. And you can't knock her hustle. That has to involve some kind of talent. Now I'm gonna say some shit that's gonna make it uncomfortable for people, but there are some things I'm not gonna bring up. Nope, nope, no. We're trying to help get your cousin out of prison, no. It really does mean a lot. Now Kourtney Kardashian, who happens to be my favorite Kardashian of all, has been blamed to be the least Exciting to look at. I think she's great. I mean, look how cute I am. But Courtney hasn't had a lot of men. There's only been Scott and then that hot model guy who slid in our DMs and told us not to objectify him with calling him a smash or a pass. <laughs> the woman has raised her children to be young, upstanding, respectable kids in Calabasas. Damn, Rain is my kind of kid. Yeah. It's wild. <laughs> Okay, okay, chill. Corey was gonna show Courtney how to raise a child right. I'm whipping her ass. Now that was advice you could have stole from the culture. I will. Okay, scratch it. Scratch. Everybody's gonna have at least one problematic child. So disrespectful. It ain't like Mason's turned out to be a bad kid. No, Kylie and Travis are not back together. Damn, Mason gonna put TMZ out of business. Who needs Harvey when you got Mason? I have to stop. And it's not like Kim Kardashian's kids are problems. I mean, North is only out here stealing people's music. Now, if they ain't gonna whoop their kids, one thing we know for sure is they are gonna whoop each other. I hate my sisters. It's disgusting to be related to you. And there's been so many memorable fights. I have a really high pain tolerance. You remember Kim and Chloe? Rude. Are you kidding me? You remember Courtney and Kendall? What the oh! Oh! You remember Kendall and Kylie? She hit me first! Oh, God! That was before she changed her lips. It was called the Kylie Jenner Challenge. It's not right. And became richer than each of them. Just buy some more. 
even Chris and Caitlyn. You were her father since she was five years old. Kim accused Courtney of stealing her style. You keep on picking out all the same clothes. I've never dressed like you. But last time I checked, Courtney wasn't black. You're so annoying. It's you people. That was a low blow. Speaking of low blow, nah, I ain't gonna do that. And that leads us to our most recent combative violent situation, aka season 18 premiere episode. The most epic fight. With Kim Kardashian West and Courtney Kardashian. Genuinely frightening. <laughs> This all started last season at the end of season 17 when Courtney said, I'm just decided to spend more time as a mom. <laughs> oh my God. By the looks of him, she ain't really been that focused. The nerve. I mean, if Mason tell the story, it's a little blurry over there. First of all, we focused yet? It's all this judgment. But then E called and said, if you want this bag, girl, you ain't gonna get your coins unless you come back to work. And Courtney came back to work. They all come back. Where is Scott? Scott! I never knew you guys wanted the Lord back so bad. Oh, he busy raising Sophia. Are you effing joking me? She Kylie's age, 20. Disgusting. Her dad is Lionel Richie. I bet when Scott seen Sophia, he said, Hello, is it me you looking for? My favorite karaoke song. <laughs> no, no. So during one of the episodes, they were sitting around talking about things that nobody in our culture gave a f about. Mom, mom tried to f bribe me with oh. money. Me too. Kim said that Courtney basically isn't reliable to show up whenever times get tough. Well, you don't care about stuff. I will literally f you up <laughs> if you mention it again and don't laugh like that. So Courtney picked up a bottle of water and threw it as hard as she could. Oh. And that set it off. Before we knew it, the girls hopped up. I saw. swear to God, I'll punch you in your face. So do it. Don't f with me. And started swinging at each other in a way that I've never seen anybody throw down. You Billy and Billy. Billy. Stop. Shut the f up. Let me tell you what Kendall was thinking. These bitches are crazy. I ain't getting in the middle of these bitches. My daddy mama ain't in this, so I ain't either. I'm gonna be like my daddy and act like a woman. I'm coming after you. Enough of that nonsense. Well, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. And let me break down the fight to you in the slowest motion possible. Stop! But not too long so we can get the f out of here. I would rather not be here. Courtney was walking away minding her business. Wait, no, no. When Kim Kardashian West flew out of nowhere and began to strike her. her. Guys, stop it! Take your nails in me. You guys, stop! Did you see Courtney try to sweep her? Stop it! She slapped the girl so hard, she left makeup on the wall. Courtney! Damn. Ow. Stop it! The winner is Jeannie. Courtney! I mean, whatever, I guess. And you saw how serious Chloe was about trying to break that up. What on earth? She didn't give a Speak for yourself. Chloe was just there to get her check. Shut up! And Kim did what any responsible party in a fight would do. She went to go check her makeup. And then when Courtney started to turn up on Chloe, Chloe is about to whoop that ass. Why are you about to hit me? Are you crazy? I'm not gonna hit you, Courtney. If I hit you, you would be knocked the out. Good, do it. And just like everything the Kardashians, Jenner do, they've inspired a following to reenact the fight. Stop! Courtney! So the moral of the story is, if you're a sister or sibling, you shouldn't be fighting with each other on TV. Dang, you think I'm strange? It, it's banana. I wouldn't fight with my siblings on national TV. No, I'm about this boy. Come on, let's go. Okay. You had you some mother years. People teach your children young that if they're gonna fight with their siblings, turn it into a check. I love when I go shopping with her. Chicken. Oh. Because if you don't, them young Kardashian Jenners will. I'm done with this conversation. Oh my God. All right, Kim, Courtney, see you at church. I literally hate you. If you love this episode with Kim, Courtney, and Chloe, and a little bit of Kendall, go over to HollywoodUnlocked.com, find this episode, and yap with me. Leave a video message, and you can even type it out too, and I might just respond to you. What are you waiting for? I'm waiting on you. Let's go.